Going back to oh, Fallout 4. Now we're left off. Yeah, there's this like big green robot rotating. And yeah, it's just the webcam in a, in a trash can with glass on it. I mean, <laughs> uh, I feel like it might be a little too rough on like the what's these robots again? Yeah, the protection. You know, they call them a webcam in a trash can, but they, they seriously do look like a webcam. Oh uh, yeah, now at least we're left off as well too. I got everything here all set up. But the thing is over here that you know, like a uh, quite a lot of the. Things that have been falling in, but not. Please, just. I need to be alone right now. Yeah, uh, yeah, I forgot. I'm like, I added this guy here to look like crippling depression. Wait, yeah, one of the things I need to do right now is actually uh, not talk to Sturge, but at least uh, meet Deacon at the old highway. And what better place to be at the Sunshine Tiny's Co-op, <coughs> which you know at least. Uh, as much as I don't like to admit it, it's kind of becoming one of my favorite uh, settlements. <laughs> could it be the, the the fort? Could it be this? Could it be that? But no, it's actually actually like the you know the sunshine co-op. It's uh, pretty gentle, I say. Sure, though, too, like nothing over here. I like, see far from good because. Out in the open, what not, I don't know. I mean, then again, I mean, most of this place over here looks pretty, pretty swell, I say. Thing is, over here now, I have to go to the quest over here and like, uh, <coughs> just turn this off for the, for over here so I can at least, uh, get a bit of affinity with, uh, I know, I got a sword, I'm a knight. But as I was saying, I mean, get some affinity with the railroad. After some fucking finally time and being be dumb enough not to find it. But hey, at least I managed to find it and uh, at the end of the day. And with that, I actually am, um, you know, quite quite thankful of it actually. Wish you could land on someone's uh, in some raider. They're gonna hear his neck crack. Or snap. Whichever will go best. Hmm, seems like the the part of sale is actually running a bit low. I think we're going to be up to 27 of these. Still, doesn't mean like there are... I mean, so it means like, still, I mean, they're pretty, pretty limited, I'd say. And the violent pond. Alright. Scavenger. Body pen. Swamp take day. Oh, he was in with the, the rat's tag hide. And what's this? Alright. So they're like gay as fuck or what? <laughs> anyway, he's uh... That's quite a bit of an interesting place before it was, you know, devoured. And a vacuum tube. <clears throat> I don't know how much junk I can carry around, but I'll be, you know, refrained from dumping to, let's say, any of the places which, clearly, it's uh... Not a very smart move, is it? But I mean, at least admit as well too, let's see, like this thing, I really collecting junk and whatnot. I hate to admit this, but in Fallout 3, is, it was exactly what I was doing. I mean, collecting like all junk over here, little, little value here, little value there. I'm probably gonna be rich as I sell them off and whatnot. But still... Going somewhere pretty good. Of course, it was always, always, always over and covered all the damn time. Perfect. Now, why did I get over here with my power arm again? I have no clue. Well, at least you know. <coughs> how can I say as shameful as it, it must have been, no, for Fallout 3 uh, back then. So at least you know, just uh. You know, snaggle up every, whatever I can find or whatnot. But at least over here kind of gives them more sense to it. What up, Yoch? Hey. What up, Deke? Deacon, is that you? Like the disguise? It's Wastelander Camo. This is my pile of garbage, asshole. Back off. Good, right? <laughs> You're lucky I didn't do one of my face swaps, too. Hmm. Huh? Almost fooled me. I almost didn't recognize you. That's the point. So, about the job. 
The railroad's only recently been using the old North Church. Our mm -hmm. old base was underneath the Slocum's Joe. We had a pretty sweet setup until the Institute found us. Really? Under a Slocum Joe? Your base was under a donut shop? It's a lot better than it sounds. Well, it was, until it was blown to hell. Oh. Blown to hell. What happened? Our HQ was strong, defensible. Heck, we thought it was secure. Inside a minute, the Institute troopers breached the doors and turned it into a shooting gallery. No. The survivors didn't have time to grab anything. So we're getting something important we had to leave behind. Sure. Something important? What exactly are we looking yeah, for? Yeah, I'll tell you when we get inside. I know that's a bum deal, but strategic ignorance has saved our organization more times than I can count. We got a tourist nearby. He or she has information on the base. So let's pump in for information before we dive in. Sure. For now, I'll take point. So I'm looking for rail signs. Symbols we use to send messages to each other. Really? If you like that, we got signs and counter signs, dead drops, even a secret handshake. <coughs> Maybe the handshake never got on. <laughs> anyway. Let the tourist speak for itself, huh? Alright. I got no, uh, not much room over here. Got barbecue, but no no fuel. Huh. And the tourist should have a trail left for us. Really now? Here we go. Rail sign. The arrow in the center indicates a direction. Really? So our tourist is up ahead. Ah! Shit, sorry about that. Uh-huh. Oh, sorry about that. Give me my, give me my wee moment. I just bayoneted him with a fucking, <laughs> with a fucking rifle. Thankfully, he didn't, he didn't retaliate back. But all right. Well, I mean, since he's keeping his rifle out, better keep in mind. Wait, that poor bastard! I, I nailed him with a bayonet. Look at the rail sign, right there. Oh, where? Oh, over there. Ah, shit. Really, they got like a short what? Yeah, short uh, ball. Uh, yeah, this is this is garbage. I like how people I like, I like how Piper doesn't even give a shit, but alright. Alright, alright, let's get a move. Oh yeah, another one over there. Probably close. How much you set up? Alright. Day. You know what? Before I actually do something stupid, I should probably go to with my whack a hag. Hag to come and fight will get whacked. That's the whack a hag. <laughs> so what's down there? This place must have been something while it was active. Well, well, you know, before the bombs fell. See the plus in the center? That means there's an ally nearby, a tourist. You take point Which on the one? conversation. Look, no matter what he says, oh. you just say mine is in the shop. Trust me. All right. Oh, perfect. Uh, take some leather armor for the uh, for the sieves, you know.
Hey, amigo. Hey. Oh, thank God. You have a Geiger counter? You have a goddamn Geiger counter? Railroad path? Mine is in the shop. Who the hell is he? HQ said they were sending one agent, not two. Sorry, I'm new. He's just showing me the ropes. All right. The wall is my witness. I thought I was dead. It's about the goddamn time you headquarters bastards got here. Status update? Tell me what's going on. I signed on for some right recon, but that little slocum's Joe of yours is crawling with goddamn chrome dome synth sons of bitches. Mm. They're sport by the hell and back. They placed mines all over the goddamn place. <sighs> Thank him. I appreciate all you've done. I hope it helps. I really do. As soon as it's safe, I'm getting the hell out of here. So if you need anything else, you better ask soon. Sure. Deacon? Where the fuck did he go? Is he at? Why is he up? Why is he all the way back over there? Deacon. Well, isn't Ricky just a ray of sunshine? Hmm. You think he's telling the truth? Uh, being honest. He doesn't strike me as the dishonest type. Yeah, that's my read too. First rule in this business is never go against your gut. So, if we take him at his word, the front door has mines, <coughs> synths, and probably other fun and exciting prizes. So, we're going in through the escape tunnel. Sure, let's move. Let's move out. You lead us there, pal. I got you covered. Down there, you sure? Alright then, here goes nothing. That wasn't as bad. Um, speak for yourself. Oh, the shooting is actually over there. You see over there some little dudes running around. Submit behemoth. Ah, good. I could watch, I could stay and watch, but for one, I got shit to do, and also that, uh, I would get my ass kicked by a. Behemoth by accident. Where's my dad right, right away? Perfect. Every little bit it helps, I, s I guess. Hmm. Dog food. Woof. Now what? Squirrel bits. One stick it too. Good stuff, good stuff. So much wood I could chop down here. Yeah, I'll have the steel to build some shit as well too, right? Wouldn't it? Uh, why don't you go into the sewer like empty handed? I mean since they apparently claim they have like a bit of no. I better have like a how can I say Yeah, might as well. Some synths over there, might as well just uh take caution, I guess. Ugh. I don't get the hang of this game now. We're in. The back entrance is safer, but be ready for Gen 1s and 2s. So it's time you learn why we're here. We're retrieving a prototype developed by our good Dr. Carrington. Ooh. Cool. Hmm. Dismantled turret over there. Dead person over there near the side. No way I'm cracking this. <coughs> We're in. The back entrance is safer, but be ready for Gen 1s and 2s. So it's time you learn why we're here. We're retrieving a prototype developed by our good Dr. Carrington. Alright. Gen 1 and 2? What can you tell me about the Gen 1s and 2s? The synths didn't start off as mm. high perfect copies of human beings. The Institute had to work up to that level of hubris. Gen oh. 1s and 2s were stepping stones along the way. The railroad's not fully united on how we feel about them. Controversy? What's there to be divided about? Everyone wants to liberate the Gen 3s, the human looking synths. Some of the synths in the railroad, like Glory, think we should help earlier models too. Really? But Gen 1s are basically the same as, well, a protectron, so the line gets muddy. 
Do we defend AI rights? Terminals? Hell, turrets? Hmm. Anytime it gets brought up, <sighs> fireworks. All the old arguments flare up. The upshot is Glory and some others won't run missions like this. Really? I don't know, just Dr. Carrington. Who's Dr. Carrington? All goes well. You'll meet him soon enough. Alright. Let's go. Ready to go. First step is to override the security line. Then do we dope? Oh yeah, I have those things that go over there. Mark over there. Dead guy over there. Pipes over there. The pipe. Light. Rock. I mean, no. Yeah, rock. More rock. Even more rock. Metal. Air. Missed one, you cocky bastards. Prototypes deeper inside. Someone left a rail sign here. This one is dangerous. Hmm. Really, I mean. Hello. Get fucked. And then we're gonna level up as well too. Wait. And I'll level up in my power armor. There we go. This is something I desperately I desperately need. Perfect. Shit. Maybe. What the hell? One stick. Perfect. I mean, the iguana stick is always pretty good. The sensitivity of my sensors clearly needs adjustment. Yeah, I'll adjust them all right. I adjust them with Wait, lead. See the box in the center of that rail sign? Hmm? That means there's a cache in the box. Looks Ooh. like Maven managed to hide something before. Well, you know, look around. I highly doubt in a place like this would ever be found, but hey. Oh. Clever bastard. You make me feel so dumb. Hey. Hmm? Hey, what? I got my attention for what then? Of course it would be, of course. Tinker managed to turn on the defenses. Barely slowed the coursers down, but hey, want to save some lives. Yeah, coursers, huh? Hello? Engaging. Control. System diagnosis. All right. Interesting. At least you know I wouldn't be able to let you turn them off. I mean to. Uh, diagnosis. Offline, huh? Shit. How about defense systems? To train professional only, limited activation turrets, hardline, criminal, tampering, warranty, that a manufacturer, there, hey, yeah, good to know. And my objective is diesel over here before I. Uh, and apparently they were fighting, they were shooting at something. Blue, we're not. Better gun. The 12, but I believe your old German technology will kick your asses. And basically the fact that I'm nearly dead as well too. In my power armor. Wait, am I? I don't know. No, I'm not. Been okay, surprisingly. The basic pistol, and that's pretty much it. Uh, Sly Nicholas. Hmm. All right. I need something more fast, I suppose. Yeah, 1911, of course. Well, too, as I like to call it. There's lots of this over here too. Guess they're not interested in sharing, huh? Eh. I am, you know, when I really need to. You stress me. I can put my my endurance on the line. What a shite.
Hello! Oh, never mind. They do... They did actually know this... This map of the turrets. A lot of good... A lot of good turret junk over here, too. Another active terminal. We didn't have time to trip the defenses up ahead. Power them up. We can give our friends a little surprise. Mm-hmm. Activate. Good. That looks pretty easy. Wait, oh yeah, apparently that's the Gen 1 synth, huh? Yeah, will ya? That's a Gen 2, apparently. Stone Cold did. Oh. All right. So what next? I know you were still there. You should know. Do I have to lock to unlock this one as well too? Fucking hell. Error. Nice. Lewd. Is someone present? Yes. Especially now they're gonna be ripped apart by bullets for my own amusement. Really? Place that never officially existed. <laughs> called the switchboard. The prototype is locked up in the heart of the facility. Hmm. I know what happened to the FBI after the, after the Great War happened. I know you are out there. They passed 199. Uh-huh. If they return, I will be ready. You see the pistol? Another one there. Yeah, one other one there's stairs. Gen 2, huh? Or Gen 1. Only with like a... Skin, like... Plastic skin all over. A charcoal bulk over here too. And tea globe. Excellent. Whistling in the dark. Interesting. And as well, the poor bastard really got ripped apart by bullets as well too. So yeah, I'm using, let's say, shitty low-level weaponry, but hey. Oh, hey there. I gotta, you know, gotta move them before, and let's see the followers decide to just walk over them. As they always do. Hello. Hello there. Mm-hmm. Hello. Hmm. Of course, I mean, after you know, looking at these synths, uh, they kind of do look like one of those, let's say, clothing store mannequins. Get fucked. Get fucked. Get fucked. Ooh, boost and fire institute. I know. Equipment can be most advanced institute since. Where's that playbook? Get that pistol. Stanley. Stanley. Salas of Co. 
What? Open says me. Mm-hmm. So Tommy Whispers didn't make it out. He died protecting our secrets. Let me see. There. Tommy would want you to have his hand. Don't let it size fool. Sure. Except you guys appreciate it. May it serve you as well heck better than it did Tommy. Ooh. Holy shit. It's like a uh Walter P thirty eight. Yeah, it's a Walter P thirty eight. Grab Carrington's prototype. You turn that over to Desdemona, and she'll have to let you into our merry band. Sure thing, sure thing. I will. So what was it looking for again, exactly? I didn't quite catch the name. Alright, for me. Oh, right, there you go. And I should close the security room of time. Carrington's prototype is in there. This thing? Perfect. Carrington's prototype, huh? Sounds like a little interesting piece of hardware. I wonder if it works. Open says me. There's an elevator at the end of the hall. It should be a hell of a lot easier fighting the chrome domes on this side of my view. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it seems like you got toasted over here too. Yeah, a lot of the little to little things got toasted over here too. Oh yeah, and then I got this little thing. Let's see how good it really is. And of course can't you know go wrong with all the oil. I mean with the oil miss and whatnot. Either hazmat suits. You know if there's anything I can do to lighten the load. Hey. No. Grab that. The fuck is she doing? Get that. That's a plan. Pick that up. Of course. Just in case. Uh-huh. Just in case. Alright, let's get a move on. At least you know to see about the metal heads over here this time, right? I mean, on this side of the, the bargain. Of course. Give me a second. Give me a tad wee bit of a second, I say. And let me work on to my beautiful stuff over here, too. go over this with strength but also just that strength uh, shit shit and here we are back into my power armor sure nothing new to do but hey Jangle the moon monk as well too. Hmm. Where would you open this? Nothing, I suppose. Rests. Warns. Deeds. Weird. Wiped. Fucker. I thought the lifts in Diamond City were fancy. Well, I mean, in a place where it does not exist. But don't worry, at least the, the ones who would care are probably long dead by now. <laughs> Fuck me. Movement detected. Curious. You must be targeted. This is why I. L oh, wow.
This is actually a pretty good gun. I love it. Need more gas canisters, because why? Because I fucking can. End of the line. Just power up the elevator. Mm-hmm. Give these things already you know like already just uh There we go. As I was saying if this thing is already you know just uh just power the terminal, might as well just what well, wouldn't think to power, but then again I can probably see why. All aboard or get left behind. It's funny as well too, let's say how the Institute couldn't be more original and they give their Institute uh, I mean they gave the Institute the voice of an elevator announcer as well too. Mini middle too. Ball. Drinking glass. Hmm. I never fucking mind. Apparel. Where did your red dress at? Why am I taking this thing? Anything over here that I wouldn't want, wouldn't need? Like, uh, how can I say? Like this, uh... Eh, uh, uh, no. Anyway, here seems to be pretty good. Seems, for the most part, like a melon I took. Seems pretty heavy. What else? Oh yeah, Stealth Boy. Shit, I actually got two of these ones and... Hmm... Sure, sure. Probably don't, wouldn't need a lot of some of the uh, things over here, I suppose. I just could, like take bit by bit rather than everything all, all the entire time. There you go. Like so. Just as so. Now I can walk away with at the, without that cost of my stamina or whatnot. So now what? What happens next? I guess we'll only know, we'll only know after the loading screen. <coughs> I thought that was my vape for one. But no. It's actually worse. Some ding sensor reading detected. Attacking human. In a second. This is normal for other journalists. What is he doing out there? I have no clue. Anyways, more for the loot for me I'd say. Sure though too I can. I won't be able to take a lot of these no for myself, but hey. I'll see what I can haggle out for my for myself here too. Even at a terribly reasonable too. Hmm. Can't go wrong with some Nuka Cola, am I right? Sweet roll. Alright. <clears throat> Wonder if that thing is still sweet. I only really wonder. Seems about right, I suppose. Seems a bit right. Oh yeah, now at least uh, since we got uh, got out of this place over here, on the way way out now, I suppose.
shit. I mean, if there was, if there was a minefield outside, I believe Deacon he spawned outside. He must have, I don't know, did his usual thing. And gun firing as usual. Busy part. I mean, even after an apocalypse, big cities can't go lazy, right? What the fuck was that? I don't know. You tell me. You tell me about. Tell me about it, man. This is gonna be fun. Well, I mean, the guy over there, he did. He did. I forget about that guy. You got better think to do. Got plenty of better thing to do. Pew, 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 pew. Uh, they go on the sea all day long. Pew, pew, pew. With your dinky little pistols. I speak for speak myself actually I guess I mean speaking for myself I actually got myself a little pistol wall too so so yeah we gotta that's part of the part of part of the big life I mean the part of the life of big city after it was you know became a radioactive apocalypse I suppose it's a quarry thing isn't it yeah I know but I'm not gonna go through there Since like the little groundhogs are all, are all the way around, you know. Would be. I think like it doesn't exist anymore. Oh yeah, I mean for the railroad to make this a little hand cannon. Must be must have been quite quite a bit of a handiwork, or not? Maybe you know they just took their piss onto like one of those little, you know, wrist watchmen. I mean, wrist watch crafter thing or whatnot, and and now they like they get like oh, what not? Ah, fuck still, will ya? Perfect. I wish you like stop rolling around too. Consumer electronics. Bourbon. Drinking bourbon in a coffee cup. Must have been some hardcore coffee, I guess. Right then. I'll go walking. I have to do like anything else better from the door here, am I right? Wait, what? Yeah. Goddamn, she still got me paranoid. I mean, goddamn paranoid. What was that? Hey! They're here! Still in one piece. Yeah, well, that's only one. I don't know more, you'll come. You think I don't know? Well, I know it. I fucking know it. Speaking of which. Yeah, he uses 10 millimeter, just like the uh, the pissed off him in 1911. 31 damage. The M1911 is about 14. Understandable, but this one did about 60. But since I'm dealing with ghouls, I'm gonna go medieval on them as well too. Good. They'd have to sneak through like a bunch of super mutants around. Guys, you can still hear their iconic voices. Yeah, it's pretty iconic. You missed what? Oh, there you go. I don't 
don't think you guys can enjoy his stim pack as well too. Thank you very much. See? Oh. Now you're about to shoot that bastard with that though. Hmm, I wanna go over here and listen to this place here too. One thing which I even I wonder is I wonder what would happen over here. I hear Brahmin. Bunker Hill. Oh, roots and rumors lead to Bunker Hill. Yeah, I'm not gonna go in there yet. Not interested. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, the scene just shuts down on, on my face. Let's get a move on. Hear that? Private property, no trespassers. We got what we came for. Let's split up and meet back at the catacombs. Yes. All right. I got all day if you do. All right. Good work. You made a good team. The best. See you soon. Hey there. I'll meet you back at the church. Okay. Meet him back at the church. At what church? The Bunker Hill. Ah, uh, old old North Church. I hope that that's the one he's talking about. Yeah, I don't see any of the church that would do. I mean, it would fit the description he would he would give. Yes, it's a church. But which church? Hmm. Coffee beans. Consumed enough already. Hmm. Underneath the catacomb of the church, must have, must have, you know, done something important in life, I suppose. Or I don't know. And the new guy patched me up, put me on his shoulder, and blasted his way through the rest of the complex. <laughs> Since everywhere, carrying you the whole time. Amazing, right? That's one word for it. Deacon told me you single-handedly secured Carrington's prototype. Disabled a mind and wiped out a hundred Gen ones. So is any of that yeah. true? Yep. 
Um, Every word he said was true, and then some. If you didn't have the prototype, I'd think you're both lying through your teeth. See? Just like I said, boss. I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. But instead, just the two of you cleared out the entire switchboard. You'd be insane not to sign him up, Des. You certainly made an impression on Deacon. He's never spoken about or lied about anyone so highly before. Welcome to the railroad, Agent. Join the railroad. Glad to be aboard. It seems we're very lucky to have you. So hmm. you're in. Now we need to know what to call you. Secrecy keeps us alive. Code names are a part of that. So what's yours? Yeah, uh, blue. If it could. Have any suggestions? No, it doesn't work like that. Your life, your name, your choice. Hmm. Charmer. Call me Charmer. Charmer. Hmm. Fitting. Your first official order is to deliver Dr. Carrington his prototype and see if he can use another pair of hands. But first, sure. it's time to meet the rest of the gang. Mm -hmm. The location of our HQ is one of our most tightly guarded Sometimes seats, the direct so approach comes isn't in the or best out. Shush. You never can tell when you're being watched. Okay. Now for Dr. Kerrigan's prototype. This is uh. it. It may lack the amenities of the switchboard, but it's safe. And we've taken precautions not to be surprised again. I Is suppose. So there's plenty for you to do. Uh, I suppose. Hello. Testimonio told me to give you this. An extraordinary feat to recover this, but that's hardly the point. Without a lick of training, and us knowing hardly anything about you, Liz <coughs> has invited you to join HQ. It would have been nice if she had consulted with her second-in-command. But what's done is done. Since you're here now, we might as well put you to work. Here to help. Tell me what you need, Doc. One of our field agents, Old Man Stockton, needs help with the runaway synth. H-222. So headquarters, as always, Puts out the fires that others can't be bothered to put out themselves. Paranoid old bat won't even tell us the problem. He insists that we get our intel from a dead drop. Dead drop? What's a dead drop? Come on, Blue. This is an amateur hour. Oh, dear Lord. A dead <laughs> drop is a mailbox with a rail sign on it. It's a common means of communication for us, so keep an eye out for them. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper countersign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. Mm-hmm. Got it. Got it. Stockton is a prominent businessman at Bunker Hill. The dead drop will be near there. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. Fair enough. I got myself the weapons, you know. I mean, of course, I got myself everything out here, so. Might as well just, uh. Put everything here to waste, am I right? If only. Only spring is missing. Has was completed. The split I could do with this sniper barrel. Glad you signed on. It means I might get to take the occasional night off. Hmm. That's a pose at least. What has it got? Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so now you know that, that it is not necessarily fully upgraded. Well, so this one could be to some extent. If only. Improved short barrel. What? Oh. There you go. If only. <sighs> well, see, it's about it. I'm gonna need rename them to be like the goo launcher. There you go. That's good enough. I like it. Well. Railroad responsibilities. Don't they need you here? My job's mainly in town. So the more places I go, the better I'm doing it. Looks and so weird. You are just one big beautiful distraction. Plenty of opportunities to learn secrets moving around in your shadow. Trade. Can we trade a few things? You do in a withdrawal or deposit? Never mind, I say. He's about right for this guy over here. Put this on. There you go. At least now he has something to protect his bald head. <laughs> hmm. What else can give this guy here too? That's one thing that I don't need over here. Track all the dead drops, and grab incoming agents, and tell them where they're needed. Yeah. I suppose you want to switch places. Sarcastic. Sure. Hope you know how to use a minigun. Oh, and soak up bullets. <laughs> yeah, you heavies need a lot of punctuality and attention <laughs> to detail, right? If so, I'm golden. We'll be seeing each other. A lot. Oh, they know something. Okay then. This thing we got big revolver. Yeah. Give me a second, let's just put in my coffee beans. Alright. Ah, 
At least now this thing is much better, I suppose. I mean, a little, little dinky pistol. A broom. Alright, now what? Hmm? Okay. Well, this was a feral ghoul. I can only imagine what next gonna attack over here at some point. What should I do? I don't know. Probably should uh, head on over to to what? Huh? Tree the dead drop, I suppose. Lost in after dark. It'll be afterwards. I'm done with this one over here. Right, take your sturges. You can st you can, if you start a fight, you can finish right putting away your weapon. There's a slight chance your opponent might forgive you. <laughs> Against uh, this guy over here forgiving me. What in the slightest chance would make you think this guy would even forgive me? Right for the journey long, but inside, yeah, yeah. I mean, look at this guy over here. It's a raider. Not to kill me. I don't imagine how many people get sleep with this thing active. Sturgis. Sounds like Sturgis has his hands full with that solo for you two are putting together. Mm-hmm. Sturgis. Everything looks good on my end. You ready to see if this thing actually works? Sure. Ready. Let's do this. You sure? Okay. Your part is simple. Just step onto the platform. I'll start scanning for an institute signal to lock onto. Then, I fire her up, and we see what happens. Mm-hmm. The music. Why are you looking like that? Okay, hold real still. I don't want any corruption of the molecular beam. Oh yeah, sure. by the way, I figured this was a golden opportunity to find out as much as we can about the Institute, what they're up to. Yeah, it, this holotape's all set with a program that will scan their network and download anything it finds. Virus, basically. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah, we better hurry. And don't worry about that tubing wiggling around. It's, uh, just there for decoration, okay? I hope so. Scanning for the Institute signal. Tracking RF. And got it. Hold on to your butt. That is, my hands don't merge with my butt. And I got through in power armor, lot too. Area clear. But seriously, though, I mean, where the hell am I now? Should I just ditch my uh, shit like what well, I could over there? So what do we got over here? Access log. Error. Signal re rerouted. Okay. Nothing to do over here. Like what? What over here? Oh. Mission parameters. X X three three four. X. Uh, of course, your chip data. The bugle repository. Mm-hmm. 
right? Internal network detected. Let's get it back. Perfect. Coarser chip data. Suppose. Data not found. What? I mean, from what I know, I mean, see, for... For I think we see this kind of coding, this is... A jumble of shit. Wait, shit. Okay, good. So now what? Hello. Who there? Who do who this? I wondered if you might make it here. You're quite resourceful. Really now? I'm known as Father. The Institute is under my guidance. I know why you're here. I'd like to discuss things with you face to face. Please, step into the elevator. I have a gun. I will shoot. Alright. Given how this is the entry to the, the I can institute. I can imagine what you've heard. What you think of us. Mm -hmm. I'd like to show you that you may have the wrong impression. No, oh, really now. Explain then. Welcome to the Institute. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. This is the reality of the Institute. This place, these people, the work we do. For over a hundred years, we've dedicated ourselves to humanity's survival. Decades of research, countless experiments and trials, a shared vision of how science can help shape the future. Really it's now. Never been easy. And our actions are often misinterpreted by those above ground. Someday perhaps we can show them what we've accomplished. But for now, we must remain underground. Mm -hmm. There's too much at stake here to risk it all. As you've seen, things above are unstable. I'd like to talk to you about what we can do for everyone. Effectively. You are here for a specific, very personal reason. You are here for your son. <gasps> what do you know? What do you know? Speak! Or else you do at this camera as well too. Can I speak as well too? Alright. Having a camera lost. Goes pew pew pew. Look, child. Sean? Huh? Yes, I'm Sean. Is it you? Sean. Is that really you? Who are you? <laughs> where is everyone? Sean, where is everyone? Father, what's going on? What's happening? Sure, the Latino just uh, being asked about to see the question about a guy in a huge power armor, whatnot. Are you okay? Sean, are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? What's going on? Father? Father! What do you want? But of course, it'll like say being shattered question by like a huge rusted ar <laughs> robotic armor. Holy shit. What do you want me to do, Sean? What can I do? I don't know you. Go away. Father! Father, help me! There's someone here! Help me! Who is Father? Where is he? Father? Father, help me! He's trying to take me! Father? Father, help me! You there. Freeze. Sean. S923, recall code Cirrus. What? He fainted. but disappointing. The child's responses were not at all what I anticipated. Really? He's a prototype, you understand. Type. We're only just now beginning to explore the effects of extreme emotional stimuli. Oh. Please try and keep an open mind. Mm-hmm. I recognize that you are emotional and that your journey here has been fraught with challenges. Mm -hmm. Let's start anew. I am Father. Welcome to the Institute. Uh 
Father? Father? That's your name? Your title? Father is my unofficial title. Oh. It's what I've come to mean to the people of the Institute. Just as... As you mean to your son. To Sean. Uh, sarcastic? Oh, God. All we're missing are the teacups and the, the white rabbit. Ah, levity. <laughs> Excellent. A sure sign that you adapt quickly to stressful invite. But I need you to realize that this situation is far more complicated than you could have imagined. You have traveled very far and suffered a great deal to find your son. Yes, who's child? Well, your tenacity and dedication have been you. It's good to finally meet you. After all this time. What? It's me. He's so eager, he's I am skipping Sean. out dialogues. I am. Your son. H how? How is that even possible? I know this is a lot to take in. In the vault. You have no concept of the passage of time. You were released from your pod and went searching for the son you'd lost. Mm -hmm. But then you learned that your son was no longer an infant, but a ten-year-old boy. You believed that ten years had passed. Is it really so hard to accept that it was not ten, but sixty years? Sixty. That is the reality. And here I am. Raised by the Institute, and now its leader. But why? But why? Why take a child? Why take you? Ah, now that's the question, isn't it? Why me? Ah. At that time, the year 2227, the Institute had made great strides in synth production. Mm-hmm. But it was never enough. Scientific curiosity, and the goal of perfection drove them ever onward. What they wanted was the perfect machine. Ooh. So they followed the best example thus far. The human being. Walking, talking, fully articulate, capable of anything. Uh... They needed specimens? So the weird science experiments needed specimens. That's why they took you. In a manner of speaking. Yes. The Institute yes. endeavored to create synthetic organics. The most logical starting point, of course, was human DNA. Plenty of that was available, of course. But it had all become corrupted. Mm -hmm. In this wasteland, radiation affected everyone. Even in their attempts to shield themselves from the world above, members of the Institute had been exposed. Another source was necessary. Really? But then the Institute found me after discovering records from Vault 111. An infant, frozen in time, protected from the radiation induced mutations that had crept into every other human cell in the Commonwealth. I was exactly what they needed. And so it was my DNA that became the basis of the synthetic organics used to create every human-like synth you see today. Mm -hmm. I am their father. Through science, we are family. The synths, me, and you. Here the whole time? And you... you've been down here the whole time? I have. Yes. I Shit. know you must have questions. Please. Anything I can do to help you understand. Kellogg. Kellogg? He worked for you? Kellogg. He was an institute asset long before I arrived here. It wasn't until I became director that I learned of all the things he'd done. Mm-hmm. What kind of man he was. You used him? You knew the man was a psychopath, but you used him anyway? <laughs> Would you have preferred that I turned him loose on the Commonwealth? Mm, true, At least true. keeping him on a short leash kept the collateral damage to a minimum. The Institute took advantage of Kellogg's vicious nature. I will freely admit that. Institute technology prolonged his life and his usefulness far beyond any normal human lifespan. 
Really? He never failed the Institute, but his cruelty became more apparent with every completed objective. I won't lie. It's no coincidence your path crossed his. It seemed a fitting way to allow you, us, to have some amount of revenge. What else mm. can I say to ease your mind? And mother. Mother. She never got to see you grow up. Yes. What happened to her was collateral damage. I've gone over the records of the incident, of course. It seems her death was an unfortunate bit of collateral damage. Nailed it. Co collateral damage? Collateral damage? Is that all she was to you? What would you have me say? The world is a dangerous place. Although I think maybe it always was. It's just a bit more honest about it now. Really For now? For years, I never questioned who my parents were. I accepted my situation... And that was that. With old age comes regret. Hmm. And asking what if more often. But what matters now is that you and I have a chance to begin again. You think? What else can I say to ease your mind? The Institute. So you're in charge of the Institute? I am the acting director, yes. Acting director. I spent decades working to reach this point. It's a responsibility I take very seriously. The Institute. It's important. Mm -hmm. It really is humanity's best hope for the future. No matter what those above ground might think of us. <laughs> uh, why you? I was the most qualified for the position, obviously. Mm -hmm. I've lived my life within these walls, dedicated to science like every other member of the Institute. My hard work has paid off. Ultimately, the Commonwealth has nothing to fear from us. Whatever you've seen or heard, I know I can convince you of that. Just give me time. I know there's more for us to discuss. But the Institute is on the mm. verge of some important breakthroughs. Your presence would be appreciated as we approach them. I've been a part of something amazing here. I've helped to build a life for myself and the people of the Institute. And now, after all these years, you have an opportunity to help with that. Doesn't that intrigue you? Isn't that what you want? More or less. I don't know. <clears throat> this is so much to take in. I know. And I am sorry. You have been through so much in such a short time. So much the in a short time? can provide a better life than anything above ground. You've been in the Commonwealth. You've seen what it's like. I assure you that you are better off with us. I don't know. I realize that. It's why I'm trying to help you. I hope that you can see Speaking. that rationally. The Institute is the only thing left in the world that is worth being part of. I simply ask that you give the Institute, me, a chance. A chance to show you what I've been telling you. We really do have humanity's best interest at heart. Will you take mm. that chance? I don't know. I just don't know. Just give it time. Give the Institute a chance. The Institute is now your home as much as it is mine. Please take some time, get to know it. Meet the people you'll be working with. You want to introduce yourself to the division heads. I didn't say Dr. That. Fillmore in facilities. Dr. Ao in SRB. Dr. Holdren in Bioscience. And finally, Dr. Lee in Advanced Systems. Dr. Lee. They've all been notified of your arrival, of course. Meet them. And then we'll discuss what comes next. <sighs> I didn't say I wanted to join in, but clearly you have like a bit of a hearing deficit, don't you? Uh, 
Now then. Clean globe. sure to think about exactly of all, all this that's been going on over here. Not sure like that at all. And yeah, I mean, you know, to give the Institute a time after all the shit there that we've seen outside, I, uh, personally did find it a bit hard to believe. And what the fuck is this thing over here? He spokes also drinks it a little too, Jesus Christ. I'm gonna need a more. It's clearly more obvious why. The fuck is this thing? Eject. Eject what? The fuck am I? As in, where the fuck am I? Broken light bulb? You this shit in here? A damaged camera too. I mean, this is brass for, for, for fuck's sake. Why would he keep this shit around here too? All right, I'm ready for a wash. Over here should be pretty much the you know, defender, right? I can't really imagine how cramped up my <laughs> inside this power armor would be. I swear to god, they better have some weapons workbench around here. A lot of good stuff as well too, or I swear to god, I'm gonna shoot everyone in my shot. Gonna head up downstairs, see what's serious over here. Directors. It's just a little big loop-de-loop. -loop. Spanner. Applicator. You examiner. Tweezers. It actually goes even down or what? I only one would have It's an honor to have you here, sir. Yeah, you better well be, be thankful. Freaking Borg. Almost done. Just need to tighten up this primary drive servo. That's the third primary drive breakdown this month. Oh. As far as I'm concerned, the phase out on these older models can't come soon enough. Oh, I don't know. Most of them have lasted long past their projected lifespans. Greetings, sir. You ask me, hmm? they were built pretty well. Oh, hey there. I can't argue with that. Even so, I'm ready to see the full Gen 3 roll out. There we go. All set. Unit, you can return to duty. Thank you, ma'am. Thanks again. Of course. Okay, then. Just a bit of a quick squat. All systems nominal. Yeah. I thought there was just glass over here, too. Is a robotics. Excuse We're all me. looking forward to working with you. I don't think you'll be needing that suit of power armor in here. Make me. Fucking make me. Our technology must seem pretty advanced by your standards. Uh-huh. Excuse me, doctor. They weren't kidding. We really are here. No yeah, shit. Right. I'm Allie. Allie Fillmore. You can think of me as the Institute's chief engineer. When Father told us about you, I could hardly believe it. You've been through so much. I think most people would have just given up. If you don't mm -hmm. mind me asking, what was it that kept you going all that time? Eh, uh, we'll survive. I guess. I just wasn't ready to die yet. Well, that's understandable. The will to survive is the most basic human instinct. Now, I'll give you a quick rundown of the facilities division, and then I'll answer any questions you might have afterward. As you might guess, sleepy. we keep the Institute's mechanical and electrical systems running smooth. Jesus, lead. how many cigarettes do you smoke? All of the systems that make it possible to live and work in a place like this. There's a lot of machinery behind these walls that recycles the air and water and provides power to the laboratories and quarters. Oh. The work we do might not be as exciting as some of the other departments, but it's at least as important. Mm -hmm. So, now that you're here and you've spoken to Father, does that mean you're on board? With what? On board with what? The Institute, of course. Sean implied you operated on a level, if not equal, and at least similar to the rest of us. Curious. If there's anything else you'd like to know about the facilities division, I'm happy to discuss it. Okay, good for now. I'm good for now. Thanks. Goodbye, then. Alright.
right, I'm not you know, pretty good at eating with Italy. Is this Italy. true? Food supplement 77 has been discontinued? That is correct. That was my favorite one. Can't we keep it a little longer? Good. I'm happy to forward your request to the Bioscience Division. In the meantime, please feel free to enjoy one of our flavorful <laughs> food supplements. I want supplement 77. I am sorry, sir, but that supplement is no longer available. Useless machine. You're here. Glad you made it. Three levels yeah. of approval. Do you believe that? Three! For food. The commissary is always open. Would you like some processed sustenance packets? Uh, sure. Let's see what you have. Institute bottled water. Institute food pa food package. Sheesh. You got Nuka Cola over there. It is this advanced systems, all right. Okay. Now that I got in, I kind of wonder how the hell I'm going to get out. She's been at it for like two hours. <clears throat> what is she even testing? Nothing. At this point, she's just doing it for fun. Hmm. Hey. I hope you and Father try to make up the time you've lost. Family is important. Mm-hmm. Excuse me. I wish I had more time to spend with Quentin, but I can't be in two places at once. I haven't been able to crack what? that one yet. That was hmm. productive. Productive of with what? It's really exciting having you here. I can't wait to see what you can do. Sure. Hey, Doc. Hmm? Oh, hi there. Sorry if I seem distracted. I memorized five sets of design schematics, and now I'm doing detailed mental comparisons. Uh-huh. Okay, what schematics? What kinds of blueprints? Mostly components for a new plasma pistol concept I've been toying with. Oh. High energy weapons are sort of a hobby of mine. Anyway, I'm glad uh -huh. you're here. I just wanted to say how much I admire Father, and that it's an honor to meet you. I really hope you'll stay here with us. Sure. Weirdo. Don't mind if I take this, would you? Sense a relay grenade. Sleep is such a waste of time. I'd rather be designing more efficient plasma emitters. You should sleep so I can at least manage to design the properly good ones. Okay then. Alright, that's what it looks like. Alright then, alright. Rushed work is sloppy at best. And deadly at worst. So do tell. Hi, Doc. Since you're new here, you should take time to learn our safety procedures. And the sooner the better. Rules create order, and order promotes efficiency. Okay. Sarcastic. You sound like my fifth grade math teacher. I hated that woman. <laughs> I doubt her rules were a matter of life and death. Failed to follow protocols in one of our labs, you could end up with a serious injury. Or worse. I had some uh -huh. handbooks made up, but that was years ago. I'll see about getting one to you. Sure, sounds good. Sounds good. Take care then. Okay then. What the fuck are these things here too? Shit. Why is it over there just dogged out? If I know why. Alright, so you gotta move on, see what I happens. I used to work exclusively on the synth projects, but lately I prefer less animated yeah. pursuits. Jesus, lady, your lipstick is so goddamn bright. She got a thicker mustache. It almost makes you look so feminist. Fuck, I don't know. Anyway, let's see what's up ahead with the other one, we'll too. You there, Courser. Welcome to the Institute, sir. <coughs> it's an honor to meet you, sir. Sure, you go around, T-800. The last time I fought that one, Eesh. We'll start the next trial, then. The dosage will be much larger this time. 
and the side effects will likely be more pronounced. Will there be any pain? I honestly don't know. I suppose it's your job to find out. Now hold still. Okay. Well, you can tell him that I intend to speak to Father there. about this. All done. You can look scary. Duties and remember to record every symptom you experience in detail. I hope I'll prove a useful test subject for you, Doctor. Mm -hmm. I can't express how truly humbling it is to stand in your presence. Hi. Once you've settled in, I'll want to do a physical and get a file going on. Get the fuck out of here. You're a doctor? You're the doctor here? Everyone's a doctor here. But if you mean physician, then yes, I'm about as close as we've got to one. How about you take some time to get comfortable? learn the lay of the land and such. In the meantime, you come see me if you need to get patched up. We'll do that check on you when you're ready. Take care of yourself so I don't have to. Sure. The med bay. Synth retention. Oh, the black line over there sure looks pretty welcoming, doesn't it? Status. All functions normal. Sure thing, toilet head. SRB. I'm seriously thinking of heading over to robotics to knock some Carry on, together. sir. <coughs> be careful wearing that. You might be mistaken for a Brotherhood of Steel soldier. Make me. Please don't. There's enough friction as it is between us and pretty much all the other departments. You going hmm. soft on me, Alana? My methods get results, and they will this time as well. You'll see. Yo, that candy store for adults. <laughs> I just feel like I'm in like one of those one of like Zaytan's Zaytan spaceships. What's her uniform? Oh shit. Creepy as shit too. You know, imagine what's down there before. The directorate should take the synth escapes more seriously. Mm-hmm. I swear I spend half my time smoothing the feathers that Justin ruffles. We need to be able to collaborate with the other divisions, and that's a lot harder when they're always angry at us. Really? Angry about what? What's Justin doing that's causing friction? Oh, he's just pushy and demanding. He thinks his problem should be everyone's biggest concern. I have to admit, though, the other divisions have never taken our needs as seriously as they should. I guess they see us as a necessary evil or something. Yeah. It's really not fair. Oh, just listen to me. It's the first chance we've had to get acquainted, and all I want to do is complain. In any case, it was good to meet you. She looked like she was hit by one of those radi radiation launcher guns. Constant vigilance is vital, preventing synth escapes. Mm -hmm. Report Doc. anything so, suspicious to the SRB. Here you are. Just mm -hmm. a nail. Acting Director of the Synth Retention Bureau. I'll be upfront with you. We're going to be keeping a close eye on you for the near future. Despite your relation to Father, you're a bit of an unknown quantity. I'm really? sure you understand. There won't be any issues, will there? I don't know. No issues. No problems here. Good to hear. Now, Father has asked that I provide you with a brief overview of the Synth Retention Bureau. <sighs> Our primary ahead. responsibility is the recovery of escaped synths that are hiding among the human population on the surface. Mm-hmm. Secret police? So basically, you're the secret police. Secret police? If that's a pre-war reference, then I'm afraid it's lost on me. <laughs> Our main instrument is the Courser, a third-generation synth assigned to operate on the surface. Coursers hunt down and reclaim synths that have escaped the Institute. They are highly self-sufficient, trained in combat, infiltration, and tracking, in a word, our coursers are relentless. But I gather you know all this, since you've encountered one already. Mm -hmm. In fact, I'd very much like to know how you defeated it. Eh. Calm. You're useless. I hate to break it to you, but your courser wasn't all that tough. Hmm. 
then it's likely the unit was defecting. It's rare, but faults can occur from time to time. <laughs> I suppose I'll have to ask robotics to perform detailed diagnostics on the entire production run. As if we don't have enough problems. <laughs> now, unless you need something else, I'll get back to work. Alright. Good for now. I'm good for now. Thanks. Very well. Give me one reason why I shouldn't. Say something, bitch. Not even he, not even he acted that as well too. I mean, at least he followed three at least, or New Vegas at least would react when you shoot a gun somewhere. And yeah, I mean, these are only bird's eye view of everything over here. Which can only mean one thing. Yeah, and the crows are sins. Pardon me, sir. I was right. <sighs> Why are you following me around, you dope? There we go, all the way down. You smell like you've been above ground. And you smell like you never showered before. Take that. What the hell does this do? Like see like a, a gas chamber, what? Access log. Fucking hell. Reclamation of units. Okay. Department notices. Alright then. Alright then. One count rifle. Alright. At some point, I mean, these guys, I mean, they're pretty. You know, hostile, and now they are the more friendly, all of us, uh, and with no given warning. At full capacity. Now you better operate at full capacity, I swear to Christ, I'll stop that in a trash heap. Now let's see what's at the robotics over Remember here, too. Remember to keep unnecessary power consumption to a minimum. Don't recharge unless your you hear primary me? levels are below 2%. Also, Sheesh. if you haven't patched your navigation software, do so after this meeting. The last thing we need is more synths bumping into walls. Scanning unknown all right. identity. That's all for Clearance now. Clearance confirmed. Resume your duties. Remember hey. to practice good sanitation habits at all times. You know, I Remember, love my work. Remember, health and happiness go hand in hand. Father even more. Huh. Hey, Doc. It's a real juggle. Trying to keep all the systems down here operating in the green. Mm -hmm. This place all might maintenance look requests new, should be directed to the facilities a lot of division. Old technology yeah, one creepy motherfucker. I sleep, worrying about when the next blackout's gonna hit. Sarcastic. So basically, this place is a sham. Great. Ah, uh, I wouldn't say that. I mean, even the older tech has held up for decades. Some even for centuries. It's pretty amazing when you think about it. Our ancestors built things to last. Of course, that was before they blew up everything in the war. Now that there's some stuff I need to check on. See you around, yeah? Creepy, but all right. What the fuck is this place? What? They have like a little thing. Oh, look at the blood circulation. Hey. Who oh. being blood? Oh. Um. Why can't it have a soul? What's it gonna do now? What the hell is this thing doing? Oh. I don't look at that one time at a time, but hey. Oh. Dr. Frankenstein's dream, I suppose. 
don't know. Welcome. Please proceed directly to processing. Get up for a moment. What the hell is this stuff over here? Hey. What the hell? I'll give him a bit of tanning. you do? I don't know. Yeah. Oh. So that's how you get the blood pumping. It'll let you keep the shit out of it. I get it. I mean, how you know they just you know got out of like uh, being completely humanized from like, uh, like really now, chunk at least. Jump from the surface. There. Maybe the next thing they make would be an original alcoholic, but robotics really? It's like uh, making zombies more than anything else. This is well, I hope. Aren't you one creepy motherfucker? Doctor. Ah, it's you. You're finally with us. I'd yeah, just like to me. apologize for any trouble our sense may have caused for you on your way here. They, of course, could be told that they're on And we have very specific protocols for protecting themselves and institute interests. Most of which I design a book, so. Not to make problems for you, though. I, uh... Will you be staying with us, then? Not sure yet. I'm thinking it over. Well, I hope you do decide to stay. It would mean a great deal to show. If you require anything, especially as it pertains to Sins, please let me know. Well, I feel like doing that. I wonder what all this red stuff is. It's gonna kind of glow in a bit or two. If you ask me, the Sins software could use a little more. What do you mean? Debugging? A bit for zombies, I mean, what's here to debug? So much research, so little time. I think. Yeah. Can you get the fucking gonna get that fucking thing out of my way, please? Thank you very much. The green one, I haven't, I haven't looked at it all too, I like the bioscience. Hey, doing some welding. A clean and healthy work environment is essential to maximum productivity. You're missing a few teeth over there. Well, I have to get to the, to the thing. Bioscience, alright. <sighs> Goddamn back is itching again. So, what's over here? Everyone's excited about the new synth project. I'm not really all that excited, but all right. I wonder how the Warwick family is doing. Young Wally must be close to ten years old by now. 
It's remarkable that any child can survive for so long up there, don't you think? I... I try not to think too much about it. We have more than enough to occupy ourselves here. Those true, people true. are the last remnants of a dying past. Mm. It's best not to dwell on the subject. They're still people, and they're suffering. We can at least admit that it's regrettable. After all, how can we hope to redefine mankind if we can't even hold on to our own humanity? True, well, true. that's a question best left to our colleagues in the robotics division. Yes, well... <laughs> I suppose you're right. Dr. Carl is doing some amazing yes, yes, things. I'm sure that what I you have to say is crops. very interesting, but now simply as... Hey, Doc. Welcome. So good to have you here. Dr. Clayton Holdren, head of the Bioscience Division. I can't mm -hmm. wait for you to see the work we're doing. It's truly amazing. Uh, okay. What work? Like what? I was just about to explain that. As the name implies, the Bioscience Division specializes in fields of study such as botany, genetics, and medicine. Our most important directive is to ensure the health and well-being of everyone in the Institute. To that end, we cultivate highly specialized breeds of flora for use in food and medicine. We've even started to explore the idea of synthetic animal life. You probably saw the gorillas. They're really just a pet project at this point, but the potential is exciting nonetheless. Oh, even zombie gorillas too? Yeah, I can't imagine anything more exciting than fake gorillas. Speaking only for myself, I find them fascinating. Of course, I might be a little biased. <laughs> I'm sure I've taken up enough of your time as it is. But I have to ask, have you decided whether you'll join us? I don't know. Not sure yet. I'm not sure. Right now, I'm just trying to keep an open mind. It's a big decision, I know. But it's also a rare and important opportunity. No need to rush to judgment. In any case, I imagine you'll want to continue looking around. Or, if you prefer, I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. Synth gorillas? Tell me more about those synth gorillas. On the whole, I'd say they were a success. Their behavior does generally match what our historical data says it should be. Unfortunately, we had a few early setbacks. The creatures can become suddenly aggressive, and they're quite strong. And they destroyed two too. of their synth handlers. So now we keep them in an isolated habitat where they can be safely observed. Also, I think it's plants edible. So like uh, gorillas. Oh, all right. Haram Haram. Dr. Holdren's synth gorilla project is showing promising results. Mm-hmm. So you were there the day the bombs fell. That must have been terrifying. No oh, shit. How I wish. I like to walk in the mission level two. Take a step. Wait a moment. Wait a second. And take another step. Wait in another second. Seeing you in that power armor makes me think we should design some of our own. No shit, Sherlock. No shit. Hey there. Liam's been trying to teach me robotics. It's more complicated than I thought. Mm-hmm. What's in over here? I'm curious now. In like a holding area or, or what? Probably got you had some good stuff lying around here, but alright. Missile. Oh, then. He's such a little dinky ding as well, too. The fuck am I? Okay. Nice. Uh huh. Uh huh. Microscope. Mm. 
Alright. Sweet. The FEV lab. Shit. That doesn't sound good. You sure this thing's doing anything? Shit. Where my look where my look where curiosity got me to. Shit, he did. Well, yeah, as well too. I mean, I heard that they were working too with the FEV whatnot, and also that let's see, like uh, our guy over there actually likes to get the like the cure whatnot, right? In his old work department, apparently. Before shit, here's the fan, apparently. Oh, well, that sound I have no clue. <laughs> Gotta be you no know, quite accurate with this thing if you don't want to miss. What's holding back? Pork and beans? Hmm. Yeah, it's quite a bit of a problem we got over here. Would be a bit of a shame if I... Wait, oh no. Not aid. Would be a shame if I ate him. Mmm. Tastes like bacon. <sighs> Fair enough. Cram it all too. I don't mind him. Some cram. Delicious salty cram. And of course, some, uh, some good old uh, sugar bombs or two. Make me feel really happy. Uh, I might prefer to pick lock, honestly. That's it. So much you know to loot over here as well too, isn't it? Some good ale as well too. Do you know what's the creepy part about this place over here? There's like no sound like at all. Masonry cabin. Puncturing pipe wrench mod. Ooh, nice. Shit. Oh shit! Yeah, speak for itself. I shit. Uh, I'm gonna need to get a big weapon for this shit. I mean, I mean, no sound or anything, there's suddenly just a, an assault run right behind me. If I can kill this one, I'll believe I can actually kill him and kill one of them. And he's well too, like, he's actually, which one's the good one over here so far I can do? I'm sure the ball can't lie. Well. That sleep in the bed with a romantic companion, blah 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 blah. Oh, I forgot again. Oh, too bad. Remind me to save again. Shit. Things so old that just literally just broke on me. Perfect. Uh, where the junk at? Where the screwdriver at? Should I just ditch it all in it like a uh, thing or not? Yeah, there you go. Screwdriver. Get fucked. I mean, return to its natural habitat, am I right? 
can over here I should probably take. Well, yeah, I mean, like, I was in level two. Alright. Can I imagine this thing has been used, haven't been used for quite a long, long time. For a good reason why level two. Oh look, it fell. It, it also fell down too. Right, I should probably know that I can take my, take my health a bit up as well too. And of course, same as usual. To be honest, I mean, of course, I mean, there's like no, no, uh, no sound, I mean, no, no music playing, of course, so it's if I enter like a bit of a combat mode or whatnot. This thing, you know, only six rounds make me, s it just, you know, bothers me internally. So like it's not a good weapon to deal with, uh, uh I don't know. Hmm. Nah, probably gonna try the robot rather than rather than destroying it, which of course it's uh, it can still be a thing, I suppose. Oh, for fuck's sake! Ah, it's expected. Sweet roll as well too. God knows how long this thing has been here. Only Lord knows, I say. Only Lord knows. Shit. Yes. Yeah, no thank you. Ouch. Okay, hold on, give me this second. That kind of stung me good. And also, I mean, since I know that robot's gonna like see where I'm at. Uh, that was... I get it. Yeah. Oh, if I can get this one killed, I'll be happy. Ah, I get fucked. Mighty pretty poor. What? Alright, take the ammo, aluminium, take everything here. The assault from circuit board as well too. Hmm. Bomber scanner. Uh, no, thank you. But it does actually more damage than the Calvin one I got. Fucker. Alright. I'm gonna get some shit here that I would, would want as well too. Alright. Have a... Biomatch scanner back, my dear. 
I blow flank and land and uh, broom into you. Cause why? Cause I can. Duct tape. Huh. Yeah, of course it like say it sure did rattle a few things up over here, hasn't it? But well, I mean, I have to, let's, I had to make, make a bit of a call for it, I guess. Well, at least I'm glad to say that I made the right one, to some extent, I suppose. Yeah, of course. You can get a quick save zone here too. I defeated a, uh, an Assaultron. My first ever Assaultron destroyed, and by God, you look like a webcam. Uh, I was never known to flip off, to, let's say, flip off Cleo, a good neighbor and whatnot. Hmm, would you look at that? Even more over there here too. Cram. Question is, how to get that one over there? Oh, I know. Forget about it. Some dorks over here as well too. Yeah, forget about it. We as good as gonna get for now. At least. Why is it dead cat in here? And why is everything so goddamn freaky as well too? To be honest, I mean, I actually got myself like a little to no reason to trust you know everything around here too, and of course as well too. Like the only sound, I mean, oh uh, the only sound as well too. Let's say that. Uh, oh, of course. I only know sound, you know, that makes it everything look more. Sure, sure. I mean the sound that makes it a lot of, oh even more even more that cat that one with the smoker as well too but like a thing as well too here like the funny thing is actually like there's no sound but right like a thing as well too let's say the sound of uh, the sound of course like uh, me. You know, do my shit, me talking, but most importantly, the sound of what's gonna try to kill me as well, too. For the only pleasure, whatnot. Hello. And there's one when it went a couple away. The glowy noise is the only thing like that, that, that you know keeps still standing. Shit. Fucking hell. And there we go. The fuck is this? It's a super mutant. But all but a super mutant all in and uh, actually a dead super mutant in a speedo, I think. With toys and a dead cat. I can only wonder what the hell happened over here as well too. Oh there you go. And I should have known about that. Cause I'm a big dum dum. Well don't worry, I mean at least got up myself over here like a said dealer stationary targets. One dropped. 
The other one, still standing. For now. And I went a couple away. With a companion, we need one. But yeah, I mean, like, like there's no sound to it. And, you know, I kind of forced myself to imagine a bit of like a one of those creepy ambient songs. But the thing is, though, too. To make, let's say, a, a game pretty goddamn creepy, I mean, the creepy areas, it's actually pretty goddamn simple. And you might be wondering, what, what's that? I'll tell you what. Just don't put any music, I'd say, over it. Oh, I'm not gonna hate myself for this. Ball. Harm. Paid. Mace. Case. Cunt. Uh, I swear, I'm not, you know, like, too much into all, into, like, this stuff over here, like, at all. End lock. Unlock. Perfect. I mean, like I said, it looks like I despise this all too. Should they give me the turrets, maybe? Ah, uh, here we are. In a chair over here. Alright. Alright then. Brains Vir Brian Virgil. Brian Virgil. Dr. Brian Virgil. This will likely be my last recording. Explain. Our requests to shut down the FEV program have repeatedly been denied. We've learned nothing useful in the last ten years. Why does Father insist on continuing it? If hmm. he won't see reason, then I have to take matters into my own hands. What we're doing. It's not right. It needs to stop. If anyone should find this after... After I'm gone. Know that I never wanted to hurt anyone. Anyone! Do you understand me? I'm gonna make sure the whole program is shut down. If not for good, then... At least for years to come. After that... I know what I'm about to do will be seen as a betrayal. Treason, he'll probably call it. So... I have a plan, and if it works, I'll be somewhere safe. Somewhere not even the coursers can find me. Everything that we've done, the lives we've taken. Mm. If there is a God, may he have mercy on us all. The experimental serum that Virgil actually wanted to. Because I'm a good guy. And holy shit, look, this is one creepy part to be into. Oh yes, of course. Play this one. This is Dr. Elliot reporting for the Bioscience Division. March 22-24. We just received another batch of subjects. But as my previous report stated, we're at an impasse here. More of the same won't help. The two most promising strains of FEV have been adapted to an ideal state, but we're still missing something. I am officially echoing the team's position. Uh, that's not sure that was a, I'm not sure that was a good idea, but... Synthetic organics requires yeah. new avenues of exploration. Additional Commonwealth <laughs> subjects will not help. It's the same problem across the board. Exposure yeah, to too much radiation. Mm -hmm. We need something... Someone new. There's a proposal we'll be putting forward. I am not entirely comfortable with it, but it seems the best course. So they actually put one of their own, huh? In that case, Virgil. Uh huh. Still hide the seal next to this section. Maybe then. Alright. Records apartment. Perfect. Yeah, look at that. No one noticed no, noti no one noticed what out while that was gone. As well, you know, like, so it's be a little overwhelming for you. 
Oh, yeah, yes, it truly is. It truly is indeed. Truly a woman or two that I can't play around, like, looting themselves, looting them while I... Uh, just let me stay over here, what not, it was too. Scatter into suit rifle, what is... Oh. Well, just impact. Mm, Alright then. But then again, like, is there anything, let's say, can, I can take from over here? I can eat? Doesn't seem like it. That about checks out well, I think. Let's see if one way I can actually get go back out there and see what I can snaggle and haggle all to myself at some point as well too. Lights go down and the stars come out. The man just forgets about all his troubles. Suppose. This dude is letting me, let's see, into his shit and Both loot. Products are available for purchase. Would you care for some? I got. What have you got? I can offer a range of nutritious and great tasting food supplements. Food Supplement 7 is very popular for its spicy flavor. And Food Supplement 91 is our newest offering. Okay. Let me think it over. Yeah, meaning that it's just let me the fuck out of here, though, too. Mankind redefined. Shit. Just minimize over here. As usual. It's catchy, isn't it? More or less. Good to see you. Yes, it's uh, very good to see you as well too. Where the hell am I now? Sure, let's play the game and look at myself like a fuck ton of ammo, but holy shit. Maintenance terminal. Okay, I'm not sure if I want to go down, but... Well, what do I gotta lose, eh? So the, all the cheery music just uh, fades off because when you realize you're not really in a good place the fuck am I sure I mean they've done their their groundwork down here haven't they Sure, they'll tell me if they actually, you know, can. I mean, give me something useful of the space over here, but no, it's just storage. This cave over there, though, too. Alright then. So I'm gonna pop out over here at me, or what, eh? Goody. Synth retention. Remember to conserve power at every opportunity. 
Yeah, you should probably get your teeth, uh, you know, back together. And... By God, aren't you one creepy bastard? I'm so goddamn freaky, though, too. Freaky, creepy, you name it. They'll get all our hidden surface, though, too. I guess only one way to find out over here, though, too. Give the whole thing to Sturgis. Alright, then. So apparently, I have to say, apparently, I have to say, just meet the rest of the division leaders, huh? Eh, fuck if I care. <coughs> Ah. One day, I'll design a more efficient reactor to replace that old clunker in the basement. <coughs> really now. So, Excuse that is only... Not. Ah, it's you. You're here then. Of course you yes, yes. know me. Yes, I know who you are. We all do. While I'm sure Father is very happy that you're here, I do hope it doesn't interrupt our work. Alright, what work? What is it you're working on? Advanced systems, special projects. You've seen the boy, a, a synth, already. We've been hard at work on him for quite a while now. Oh, before I forget, let me see that pit boy of yours. I've been told to install a coarser chip in it for you. Father's orders. You're to be given full access, with the ability to relay in and out of the Institute at will. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, I'm sure that'll come in handy. Given that the relay is the only way to access the Institute, handy is something of an understatement. In really? case the significance is lost on you, you'll be the only one here with that kind of access. If nothing else, it should demonstrate the amount of trust Father has placed in you. Now, unless there's something else, I really do need to get back to work. Uh, everything okay? Is everything okay, Dr. Lee? You seem pretty tense. Yes, things are... It's fine. I'm sorry, I don't socialize much. I prefer to focus on my work. Figures. I install a cursed chip on my pip boy. Ah, uh, yeah. For the time being, I believe she just goes to the Sunshine's Titan Co op for the time being. Because he's just right over there, though, too. Well, too, I mean that I have to take your face to finish the uh, the, uh, the thing around the ping. So the ping can be good for the ting, which protects from the other ting and the ting that does the ting. <laughs> I'm just I'm just messing around. Every is Massachusetts Scientific Journal because he collects the eggs a slight increase in every limb damage. Some dope ride. Huh? Doesn't seem like a great place to mingle with me. Yeah? Don't much care for good neighbor. That place is nothing but trouble. All the junk in. Now what? See if at least you know for starters play some turrets in a place like this, because Jesus Christ, they need some. Ah <sighs> whatever. Still better than nothing, I, th I suppose. Like, do you want What do you think? I might be working over here. Like, uh, that sure it. No, it wouldn't work. This over here, too big. I mean, if I can put over here, right? It's a nice standing point for the thing. Eh, that'd be amazing. If only, right? If only. And as a matter of fact, I think I might have like a bit of solution for that. I believe. Right? At 
these put something over here. For fuck's sake, make up your goddamn mind. Right? Now. Theoretically, I could be able to at least place it over here. As there would be as it was show like this, but no. Yeah, let's turn the workshop at least for now. I don't know if I'm gonna I to put at least over here like this it is, but I mean to be honest, if I like a proper structure, at least put a turret over here, at least be amazing. In the meanwhile, I suppose I should just like just see if I can finish out the junk fence over here too. Really about at least about thir thirteen of these ones. Alright, what's the, what's the best model there is over here? This should do at least over here. Usually you see about at least to see finishing up, you know, the, at least over here as well too, right? up a few things with like a spare piece of wood I got lying around. to be amazing. Well. Sure as well too. Like it takes its toll on you know, the rubber you know reserve that I got over here, but hey, better than us, am I right? Better than fucking nothing. Like it's things are goddamn laggy and whatnot. Certainly in good place. At least you know the junk fence over here, the rubber tires. That shit works like a charm. But holy shit, man. I have to tell about these are the ones here, too. Dude. Yeah, so they're gonna come into over here. A bit of a patchwork over here as well, too. And. Oh, they will see. This place is gonna be an independent. In, in, an impenetrable fortress when I'm done. See? Look at that. It is almost into perfection, yeah? Oh, oui, c'est très, très bellissime. J'aime. C'est art. C'est le... <laughs> Uh, my French is not, my French is actually is actually not that good, but hey, it's getting there. J'adore les art. Remember, I feel, let's see, put like a bit of a gate over here as well too. Right, maybe the only place in and out. Perfect. How much does you know set me back to? Yep, well, at least only one piece. Amazing. Putting like a fence around like a wait, rubber. Shit. That would make any, wouldn't make any difference that wouldn't it? Perfect.
It should about do it. Should. I'm not sure about this woods, this, this uh, post over here. So I'm just gonna be a, a random post over here for no goddamn reason. Why? Again, again. Oh, how I wish. You know, just finally just put like the curve over here, sitting over here, pretty goddamn cute. That'd be amazing, but no. But no. Where can I put this one over here, to be honest? Take cover here behind the behind rock, yeah. Could be. Electric power, generator. I can put like a large generator. Perfect. When we're gonna put this over here, too. Which clearly is red. See here, it's quite a, it's quite something, yes. And it has its own little light as well too. Fascinating. If I only had one small piece of gear, I would have been able to make myself another one. Heckin' damn it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Must have a little terminal over here if I really wanted to. Interesting. Interesting, I would say. See one over here that's not assigned to anywhere. Of course, the fence over here is up to 14. Sure, it's almost good. Now that I wouldn't, you know, wouldn't re require him to discard. That was the thing over here. I know. And of course, carrot. I could just eat it directly as well too, couldn't I? But yes, I could. And of course. Of course. To find a place where to snuff there some carrots into. Like over here, like it's pretty it's pretty tense, eh? Perfect. Melon! Bigger that I had more than one. No wonder why I was so was some so goddamn heavy as well too. Make some more of a juicy, refreshing watermelon. Am I right? Good shit, I'd say. Very good shit. And of course, some moot fruit plant as well too, which apparently I had it with me for quite a while. Actually, no, it's on the. Uh, Reserve thing. Conjures over here, I would really love to, but <coughs> the thing I got so far working was like, was like that only a uh, well, only that one. That's pretty much it. So yes, I suppose that it should be pretty, pretty good. I suppose. So I don't hear any more complaint about people not having enough, enough place to sleep and whatnot. I uh, suppose I could just uh, start slapping up some of these things around, I suppose. And there you have it. Chairs. Of 
Whereas if I had steel, I would be able to place some of these things around too. But do I need a chair over here? I have no clue. I cannot formulate a logical explanation why I would need a chair over here. I mean, if I was making my, my, making my own home over here, maybe, but no. Shelves. Hmm. What if... Just what if... Ha, I wish. A blithering wish that was possible. But hey, reality, reality is a bitch. Can't have everything in life, am I right? Flag. Mm -hmm. I mean, I could at least block it off with a painting. Don't know if that's gonna do any good. I mean, I don't know. Steel for this movie, which I clearly don't have. Uh, let's see. I can put myself a bit of radio over here as well, too. Classical radio, Diamond City radio, Radio Freedom. And some meat bags here as well, too. Eh, uh, clearly doesn't seem much like it. I did as much as there could before this place over here. Sure, yeah, well, so let's see, I'm a circle of courtesy. If we occupied the forest at this, that is this place over here, too. Yeah, so a few glowing... I think he's here, though, too. But hey, I mean... Hmm... Probably put a turret over here and... that would be a dick and snipe. Good idea. Get the turret, put it over there, and let it let them snipe people, because what the hell not, right? I mean that is if that is even gonna be a thing, right? Theoretically it should be. Theoretically. Then Spiper, you know, obviously let's say voice her just her concerns about let's say out here being too much in the open, right? If we don't get the right one, let's see, I could probably make myself a nice little barrier with these, uh, with the wooden poles. And, uh, I mean, sure, it might be a bit of a lighter turret, but it wouldn't be able to receive much damage. Come to think about it. Clearly over here, though, too, like, there's a bit of, like, a, a little something I can't like, feel it could be done over here. Sure, I mean, to snipe whatever comes over there, but if that is even, if it, that's... That is, if it's even gonna happen, well, right? Because sure as well, too, let's see, there's a lot of, say, like, an int interesting place I can put these turrets into. But, the thing is, I mean, it's just like a lot of, there's like a lot of lost opportunities, I'd say. Mm, I did try. I did try. Huh? Uh, what? Let's trade some things. Of course. No, there seems to come out with me with that kind of stuff over here, Jesus Christ. Mm, I don't know. Uh, I really wish you know, could use like the synth, synth really grenades uh, over here. And, uh, you know, what would I say? jump top of this one and like just assign it to do the work over here now that shit would be amazing but no anyway then to talk to Sturgis right good get yeah, the hot tape to Sturgis with like the stolen thing or not mole rides off and travel on the ground and they burst to serve to ambush their prey I really like the extra set of teeth they got the teeth he got forward and like, yeah, those human-style teeth. 
a gut as well. It's actually pretty freaky to be honest. <sighs> Started just my boy. There you are. Here's that holotape you gave me. Full of institute data. I hope. Well, alright. I'll start digging into this and see if I can make heads or tails of it. Sure. Uh, expecting to find? What do you hope to find? Whatever the Institute doesn't want anybody to know. Uh, all the good stuff on here is going to be encrypted. So the first job is to see if I can crack it. After that, well, I'll have to see what I've got. There's no telling what we might have grabbed off their mainframe. <laughs> Press like it, Pepper like that, goody. And of course, as well, too, to our dear little friend. You wanna get out of here? I don't think we'd make pretty ghouls. Oh, trust me, we are more sexy as we are. And into Virgil's laboratory we go. Hell is he? There he is. Can't well, see him. I'm glad to see the relay didn't completely vaporize you. Mm-hmm. Sarcastic. You did, but I pulled myself together. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose you did. Now, what about the serum? Did you find it? Mm-hmm. Uh, get the serum. Got it right here. That's it. That's really it. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Retrovirus has matured nicely. Density gradient is high. Recombinant counter intron sequences look stable. Transcriptive exon strands have formed. Uh, test it? How are you going to test it? On myself, of course. That was the plan. This serum will only counteract the specific strain of FEV that I infected myself with. There's no telling what it might do to anyone else. Yeah, because he's pretty happy since he's already climbing to his lab and whatnot. Right. Here we go. Oh. Uh, uh, no. We wait. Sarcastic? That's it. What? Did you expect me to transform right before your eyes? This is science. Not a two-cap magic show. <laughs> I'm going to rest for a while. I'm back in a few days. Give me a week and... Well, I guess we'll see. In any event, you kept your end of our bargain. Thank you. But it's funny as well too how, it, how they actually... Uh... I mean, it's actually kind of a bit funny as well, too, how, uh... Protect and serve. I mean, even... Oh. Well, that's called music, huh? Mm-hmm. Protect and serve. Good to know. Virgil? happens. Thank you. Hmm? I'm going to get some rest. Just have to wait. I'm going to get some rest. Yeah, you can get some last late some sleep late, yes. And now you're going to see where we go. But then again it's fun as well too, like even let's say like a See the past fall games and still nobody learned the lesson about the FPV. And most likely never will apparently. 
Well, yeah, I mean, whatever keeps, you know, the... Uh, give, like, life, you know, the, the game, right? Or at least the game series. One of the evils that feel that they need to be destroyed, and... Why is this thing just floating on top of me? That's one thing I want to know. But regardless, let's head back on to the, uh... Sanctuary. Uh, the railroad is primarily instrument since you there are the kids. Oh, interesting. I feel like it kind of like just, you know, uh, let the railroad in the dark for quite a while. Oh, uh, yeah? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, this one already as good as it is. Uh, I wish for a jetpack if I could. Advance, isn't it? Hmm, seems about right. <sighs> Giving myself here some other power on over here. It's all T forty five. Is it? Early T45, and the most basic, you know, power that anyone can ever get. I forget about this one. The one I think that I need to focus on to the most. I want to go for this one over here. I need to find some aluminium and some oil. And I got the goo launcher, I like to call it. Right. Short scope. All the good stuff here as well too. Medium night vision. No bayonet. Yeah, everything here is if you check it out okay. Let's see, let's see what I can do for this thing over here as well too, right? Shirt scope for this thing over here. Yeah, that that works out pretty goddamn well, I'd say. Improving shot recoil. Hmm. Fair enough. I 
got no clue to do over here, at least over here for the time being. Well. Always was a little jealous of folks who could craft something other than a paragraph. <laughs> I should probably check out and know what's going on, at least on the other side of the Maya. Let me know if there's anything I can do to lighten the load. Or, you know, if you need anything proofread. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully. But now some, you know, I'm starting to feel myself pretty goddamn sleepy about now. I should probably... How can I say? I should probably head off all the way back to the Red Rocket Trick Stop. Where my home sweet home is. Right? You can probably see over there as well too, like the... The ugly ass shack. Doesn't matter how much you try not to get rid of these guys over here, they just... I don't know, just torsos abandoned over there. I have to admit it too, I really like the T-45 power armor. I mean, the idea kind of looks and everything. It's not as I it's not as good as it may seem none in practice. And as unfortunate as it, as it, as it may seem as well too. My back hurts, my feet hurt, everything hurts. Yeah, it's a good kind of pain I think. Keeps you strong. That doesn't sound good. What the hell just happened? I see fire burning over there. Piper, what the hell is going on? The raider. Only one raider. Get <laughs> fucked. Hmm. Just one raider. Shit. Seems about right, I suppose. Seems about right. I don't know if he can. Done and done. Oh, uh, is he going to? Is he really going to? <laughs> okay. And do. to go you know take care of the okay the carrot and here's little old me as well too That doesn't look good. Yeah. As I was saying, that indeed doesn't look good, doesn't it? I wonder how long it lasted. If one already got killed or whatnot, but still. Really now? Yep, one died. Really? And that guy over there just... Yeah, that one lost lost hope in life, apparently. Thanks a lot. Excuse me. Out here? You gotta take things one day at a time. Mm-hmm. I can clearly tell, I mean, that this guy over here lost a... Uh, 
lost hope in life. I mean, no, no, I mean, but none lost as much hope in life as this one over here, too. I mean, he just got stuck over there while he's let his buddies being ripped apart by bullets. Let's see where the goddamn, uh. There. And of course, the junk. Go all in. Of course, it will too. Like, see some of the weapons over here, as well, too. Yes, yes. I can be spiked. I can be for puncturing. Holy shit. And I can also make it bladed. But no. This is good as junk for me, I'd say. Seems about right. Now what? See if we can get Kemsel too. We need Durg. Yes, we can make Durg. Buff jet or buff tats. Grenade. And refreshing beverage. Let's just stim pack first. Gotta main part, gotta Keep my priority set, I suppose. Cryomine. Okay. Okay. I don't want to use it. Can you do this cutting fluid with? But hey, I did it. I did something. Need to get back to Diamond City one of these days. Biggest town I ever saw. Yeah, I probably doll that. It's almost complete, I guess you can say. Railroad and... I mean, a mixture of Railroad and... And Minuteman. Well, looks like it seems about to work out well. You know, see about the guns over here. At least put away the the barbecue, because clearly I don't really have much use for this one right now, do I? I mean, I have no fuel. Just over here, just wasting, just taking up space. Mm. Don't need 
need this. Do that. Oh, wait, wait, what? Yeah. Yeah, I'll take this back. Thank you. I'll clear my quite hard another back. And what next? <sighs> it's the first you skip the set pad hand. And what else did I take? I like, uh, what else can I do over here too? Hmm. Should probably leave this here at home, I suppose. I haven't been using like 45 CP that much, so leave it here. I don't toss it around accidentally and screw myself over. Alright. Everything here seems to be going out A-OK. -okay. Or so it would seem. this thing wouldn't be. Like I'm looking for like a, you know, a thing that I wouldn't need. Leave it be as it may be. And I, for now, I'm pretty tired. My eyes are so goddamn heavy as well, too. But hey, I mean, I gotta make sure you know some things are here are working to be a-okay. Got over here. Oh boy, it's not just a... Uh, I mean, I swear, it's not just a... Uh, you know, I mean, construction over here. I'm all the way here. So, some art, I say. Some lot of, a lot of good art. But it's fun as well too here. Like, uh, I mean, how I just love those three turrets over there. Apparently I have to let's see, get a go get go make my way over here. I mean the super I mean just lost the you know the silhouette the silhouette of that few submissions over there. And they just walk over here and I mean they're shooting but they were missing. And of course just being ripped apart by bullet by bullets. Let's see what I can build over here. Maybe some, some more turrets maybe? Maybe some more turrets. But I would really will love some more turrets. Make them more. Yes. More. Mm hmm. It's funny as well too how, how much, you know, it's... It's literally like not needing much for this one. I can... Get it done pretty good and easy too. Power pylon. Plyon. Uh, something like that. I don't know. Hmm. Lovely today, isn't it? The American flag is, has so much freedom, it penetrates like uh, steel. Clearly, as well, too. Let's see, putting like this straight over here is uh, a little too. How can I say? Quite a bit of a nasty surprise, huh? I don't know. Yeah, there's like another one over there as well, too. The best place to put this one would be right about here, I suppose. Sure, it looks like there's like a... Some of these things here are to be openable, too. Hmm. I 
can I put over this guy's uh, stupid face, I, I wonder? Oh, I think I know what could be. Some decorations, right? Maybe a sign, at least. Protect yourself. Caution. How does material? <laughs> Protect yourself. I actually just put hot dogs. I could kill some kill some food right about now. Space some noodles. Yeah, some good noodles. For rent. If only. No trespassing. Hmm. I can put over here as well too. Liquors. <laughs> Actually, it looks pretty cool. I don't know. Like these wall multi let's see for let's see playing basketball. Sure at least you know playing basketball over here in a I bet the post apocalyptic wasteland over here should be pretty fun, I, I suppose. What's the point of a, of a wall mounted one with this one already over here, right? Cool, I say pretty cool. I don't know. I'm just thinking about what what different things I could do right now and in, uh, in some different ways or two. Ah, uh, fair enough. Should be as good as it could be as it can get for the time being. Hope you guys enjoyed this as much as much as I did. As I look forward to the next one. So see you guys next time and until then. Oh!